My name is Randy. I've been a home infusion patient for seven years. I was diagnosed with ulcerative colitis in 2015, just after high school. Ulcerative colitis is an auto, autoimmune disease uh, that requires me to receive infusions every eight weeks or so. So in the beginning, I had to travel every which way. I had to go to um, several clinics or even the hospital, which is a little far away from here. Um, and that was a little bit hectic in terms of trying to navigate that process. My mom is actually a nurse uh, and she suggested that I look into home infusion care um, because it allows us as a family and then myself to, to receive the treatment in the comfort of my own home. I've been a nurse for 33 years, so um, home care infusion is not new to me. In the beginning, I was still worried because scheduling home infusion, I know, is not going to be easy and him being away from college will not be an easy fix. Luckily, we were able to find someone who is very flexible, uh, who can do uh, weekends when he comes home from college. My home care nurse has, has been fantastic. I, I've, knew, I've known her since uh, before I was diagnosed. Um, and it so happens that she is now my returning nurse every so often. Um, and we kind of build a you know, relationship over time and she's, she's considered part of the family. I give kudos to these home care nurses. They develop relationship with their patients and I could see, you know, with um, his home care nurse, she is actually um, an angel because she cares uh, for all her uh, patients. When she is not able to come for him, which was very rare, she always makes sure she finds the right person to do the job, and she's done that for us. In my experience with Hackensack, uh, home infusion service has been is amazing. Um, my home care nurse has been fantastic. She's been very caring and uh, supportive of, uh, uh, of my treatment and therapy. I would recommend Hackensack Home Infusion Services because it's like having uh, your, your friend, your family take care of you. Mm -hmm.